Clan lose 6-5 to Belfast Giants tonight. With me is the head coach, Ryan Finnerty. Uh, Ryan, can you take anything from the game tonight? Uh, yeah, but, you know, obviously we, we got behind and battled back and showed some good character. And then, uh, yeah, we, uh, we went in the lead. I thought we should have gone in the lead with a 6-4 lead, uh, you know, but the, uh, the stripes felt differently. And, you know, you're making calls from a long ways out. It, it, it leaves yourself wide open for judgment, and that's where I'm frustrated. And, you know, Belfast had one, you know, uh, Keith in the crease there taken away too. So frustration when, when you watch it back and it's a goal. And, and those, are, those are now deciding games and, and massive games. You know, you work too hard to have it decided like that. And it, it's frustrating in that aspect. I thought the guys battled pretty hard. Uh, and then, uh, you know, they capitalized on a few late power plays, and that's the difference. And Belfast are top of the league, and now they're 11 points cleared for a reason. But you obviously feel as though you, you could have matched them tonight, maybe even beat them. But how do they stand in terms of the other teams in this league, in your opinion? Well, they're good. I don't want to sit here and talk about Belfast all night. So they're, they're good. They're top of the table for a reason. Their depth is, is incredible. Uh, they're well coached, and, and they come at you. you know. But I felt tonight, I felt, I felt it was taken away from us. I felt we, we got it taken away from us. And you know, I don't need to tell you. I think everybody in the, in the attendance saw that tonight. And sure. it's pretty evident when the, th when, the, when the three guys left what, how they felt. And I felt they took a good game away from, from a deserve, two deserving teams that, that should have decided who won that game tonight. And unfortunately, it wasn't that way. Five goals, uh, three scorers. Kevin Bergen getting a hat trick from a, a clan point of view. Positive in that respect? Yeah, I mean, obviously scoring goals isn't an issue for, for this club. It hasn't been an issue. It's, you know, but... We, 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 we open it up and, and we, give, we give up some goals and, and it, you know, obviously, you know, that game tying goal was, was tough and, and then, uh, and then they, they, uh, they jam another one in, you know, and we, we just didn't have the legs at the end to, to penetrate and, uh, you know, I thought the guys can't fault them. I thought they worked hard. You know, they, they battled pretty hard all night, especially going down 3-1 and coming back. Um, should have been going in 6-4, but that's the way I, those are the breaks and and you know what when you're on top of the table I've been there playing you get those calls and last night we score a goal in Belfast and it's not a uh, deemed not a goal tonight it is you know and, and those are the small breaks that, that you get four points on you know last night Murph's Murph's makes a save behind the goal line nobody's there to to uh, to call it a goal and they go back it's not an excuse it's reality when you're winning you, you need the breaks and they got them on to Edinburgh tomorrow, just a chance to regroup and, and get start things again. Yeah, obviously, you know it's going to be a tough, tough battle here, three and three, and um, you know we got some tired legs over there, so we're going to have to have to regroup, pick ourselves up, and, and go to work to, uh, tomorrow in, in Edinburgh. Thanks very much, Ryan. Thank you.